Sheriff Chris Swanson arrested 22-year-old Peter Pagic at Detroit Metro Airport yesterday. Swanson tells TV5 that's where Pagic flew in from his home in West Palm Beach, Florida, and sexually assaulted a 12-year-old girl in Mount Morris Township in February. It's unknown how he chose her, but it's not uncommon that they send messages out to thousands of people because predators like him, that's what they do. Swanson says Pagic initially reached out to the girl on Instagram in a private message before moving the conversation to another gaming chat app called Discord. That's where he reportedly groomed her and offered her cryptocurrency. Swanson says that after the reported assault at the Baymont Inn, the girl told her parents they took her to the hospital and that began the Ghost Task Force investigation on March 10th, a little more than two weeks after the reported crime took place. Within that time, Swanson says Padgett struck again. Our entire ghost team feels somewhat uh, of a, a failure by not catching it sooner because we were unable to save the experience from two other young victims a 16-year-old in Washington and a 14-year-old in Oregon. Investigators went to Florida to bring the man here to face charges. Padgett was arraigned today on 12 felonies, including four counts of first-degree criminal sexual conduct. He had no prior criminal record. A student at Palm Beach State College, where he worked as a part-time security guard. Padgett also worked in a local Italian restaurant. To pull off what he's being accused of, Swanson says he ripped off his mother to buy a plane ticket to Michigan. So he didn't have the money, he stole it from his mom, even though he's a 22-year-old man, and she said, you're not doing that, booted him out of the house. Now the sheriff's office worked with the FBI in the investigation. Padgett's charges have the potential to bring a life sentence. He's due back in court on April 4th.